Thanksgiving Day runs are taking place all over the country this morning, but this one here in Japan isn't about how fast you run, but more so, who's sporting the best costume? I don't care if you place yeah. first. If you run fast, Great. who cares? That's cool. Yeah. I care about the best costume. Good work, good work. It all started 14 years ago by this brother-sister trio. I think you were in California, you were in Massachusetts, I was in Vermont, and so to come up for the holidays, it's important to probably, A, burn some calories before you eat, but it was nice to just run together. Originally, it started out as just a way to get a run in with friends before Thanksgiving dinner. You didn't want to run alone because it was cold and it was dark, so we ran together. But soon, it took on a life of its own. It was, it was some of our friends. They just came one year and speed us. There was just this crew that came and it was funny. But then the pressure to dress up became um, more real. And that got people's attention. Neighbors started saying, who, who are these guys? Yeah, like why is the Elvis and a sumo wrestler running through the neighborhood? Then it, it kind of became irresistible, I think. Eight years into the race, the family started raising funds for shelter for the homeless. To this day, they raised $40,000. And it's important to note, all that money goes directly to providing meals all throughout the year. It's a great day, it's great music, it's great fun, it's great to see people you haven't seen all year, it's great creative expression. At the end of the day, we've, we've raised a lot of money for a great cause. Around 350 people took part in the race today, proving this time-honored tradition isn't going anywhere. I, 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 th I think it's, I really think it's like a real expression of the three of us. For It's Relevant News, I'm Diana Blass.